we bring a, a unique solution to the rebar industry that, that really is the first of its kind. The gavel bar is a, a product that can be used without special equipment that's able to be fabricated after it's galvanized. Produce gavel bar, we start out by bringing in uh, raw material, black bar. Uh, it'll process through a conveyor system. Next step is abrasive blasting. And in that process, we're, we're removing iron oxide, mill scale, any contaminants from the steel to prepare it for the galvanizing process. Unlike a traditional galvanizing facility where they're using chemicals to help pre-treat the bar, uh, to help clean the bar, we use abrasive blasting for that cleaning mechanism. It's a chemical-free process. So after the blasting, we then move into a flux solution that helps pre-treat the bar. It is a metallurgical bond, not a mechanical bond, so you need that flux for the galvanizing to adhere to the bar. After that process, we move into a preheat stage with our induction heaters. It helps instantly turn from ambient temperature steel to our operating temperature within seconds. It then enters into our, our galvanizing process. Zinc is actually being pumped up into uh, another basin to where the bars will run through and get coated. After the bar exits the canopy, it's at molten temperature, and we've got to cool that down for handling so it passes through an uh, air-cooled water trough. Once it's cooled down temperature, it runs through the next tank, which is the passivation treatment. Then it moves to a kick-out line where some arms will activate once the bar is completely ran, and it'll lift the bar up off the line and it'll slide into a bundling station. As soon as a whole bundle is ran, a team of guys will then put some strapping on the bundles and it's ready for shipment. They know they're going to get a long life out of it. They know when it goes into the field that it can be formed, it can be handled, it can be cut. And they're still going to have that protection. Unlike other products, they're going to crack or they're going to flake. And that's why we do what we do. We know we can offer a better product. And no one's done what we've done here. They've attempted this process, but no one's perfected it until Yavobar came along and perfected the process. <laughs>